Hey everybody, and welcome to Hexiled Gaming. I'm Scott, and I've got the top four uh, in the hyperspace trial here in Durham, North Carolina, Atomic Empire. This match between Alvin on the left and Jason on the right. Um, we uh, <laughs> we got as far as we could without featuring, <laughs> you know, more Republic and Resistance lists. But uh, here we are, top four. You gotta you gotta represent. And Alvin's doing it. He's got Obi Wan with the uh, Regen R2 Astromech Delta Seven title, a naked Rick, ooh, brave, and two naked Arc 170s. And then we've got Jason, the last player not flying Resistance or Republic. He's flying that Separatist swarm, four Trade Federation drones, a Techno Union bomber, and Grievous. We've got energy shells everywhere all the drones have grappling struts and grievous with kraken helps with that uh, action efficiency keeps more of those calculates on the table um, we've got probe droids as well which i imagine we will see deployed this turn um so yeah jason just came off of a win against the top ranked opponent in uh in swiss the only undefeated player in the cut. So, feeling pretty good about his chances, but uh, also, the Republic, pretty good. Got the beef, got the ace play. Uh, a lot to like about these Republic lists. There's a reason why they're so popular. Um, the arcs are going to move up and focus. Try and flank as uh, as good as a, an arc 170 can. Um, Alvin expressing some disdain earlier about uh, <laughs> Rick versus um, grappling strut drones because they can reveal, um, you know, three speed maneuvers and just sit on their rock. So they can sit and spin, but still match Rick's dial and shut down his ability. So maybe we'll see a little bit of that today. Um, Alvin very cognizant of the way Jason wants to use these rocks, so he tried to pull a lot of the big rocks towards his edge and leave a large space in the middle so that these uh, Volters can't just sit there and um, spin around, get that defensive buff from the obstructed shots, etc, etc. Alright, here comes the probe droid, throwing it out the front, going to put it in the middle of the mat here. Ober mutant, thank you for the follow. Yep, Rick moving up the top. Uh, Obi-Wan looks like he's going to move towards the middle, but there's plenty of room here. No need to commit to that. Really just depends on what uh, what Jason does. Does he keep going straight up the mat? Or does he turn in here? Failed. Thanks for the follow. The ideal engagement for these uh, for these drones would be to come in with, you know, double calculated on at least three ships, probably the front ones, which is what we saw Jason do last time. And hopefully with target locks, I don't think we've seen that happen at all this tournament. But Jason still makes it work. It kind of punishes you from playing too slowly because you give these probe droids more time to move into position and you give a free turn for these... Uh, Trade Federation drones to target lock. I guess there's not a whole lot of downside to engaging them f quickly, except if you deploy the way Alvin did, you're not going to get all your guns on target. And yeah, doing four forwards, getting as far away from the arcs as possible so that if they get an engagement with Rick or 
Anakin, um, at least it would be against those two ships and not all four. Mega Silver says, so much theme going on. You know what? You're right. Wait, that was quack shot. Mega Silver says we just needed this match on the crate cup map. Uh, I went with a, a generic mat for today. Um, yeah, quack shot. So much theme going on. You know, you know why didn't I? Why didn't I think about that? Yeah, we do have a Republic versus Separatists. Very thematic. Grievous and his army of drones versus Obi Wan and Anakin and their two arcs. Yeah. I like it. Do we see another probe? Not a whole lot of reason not to drop it. Oof, double negatives. Oh, not Anakin. You're right. <laughs> You're right, that's Rick. What a... Uh, what a silly man. There's the full throttle evade and a boost. Two forward from Obi-Wan. And yeah, it looks like they're gonna let the uh, the drones move past them and hope to engage on the side. Uh-uh. <laughs> Apostasis, I know what you're trying to do, and I will not engage that. <laughs> Ooh, look at this. Rick, going to shoot the uh, the probe. Put him on probation. Ooh. Alvin asking a good question. There's no revealed maneuver for the... Uh, the probe, so does he get his ability? Ooh, Natty's for the probe! <laughs> hey, Rick, get probed. No bonus, yep. That's what they decided as well. Here's three dice off the front of the arc at the probe. For the focus. Spins it for two. There's two evades. <laughs> hey, let's hear it for all the uh, hard working probes out there in space. Flying around, getting shot at. Just trying to help out their droid brethren. All right, and this one lives. Takes two shots, shrugs them off. Oh, Amastasis. All right, drops the uh, second probe droid. We are fully probed and ready to go. Timo says, Rick ability only works versus ships. Good to know. Yeah, is higher than the enemy ships rolling addition. That's a good point. Um, remotes are not ships, so thus they do not uh, trigger Rick's ability. But I'm, I'm sure Rick is feeling pretty triggered about it. So we're definitely going to see these drones turn in. Do they do ones? Yeah, Maui a little late to the party. But he always gets there. Two bank out of these probes. Alright, here's the one hards. Ooh, going for those locks. I like it. Yeah, Timo bringing up a good point. 
Rick doesn't work versus ionized ships because they don't reveal a maneuver as well. Some of these gonna get locks on uh, on Rick. I dig it. I, I like I like the target locks, but it seems like you do want a few more calculates for networked. He gets the double calc on Grievous, but Grievous can't share his calculates. Oh, yeah, yeah, they're rolling it back because it's not Grievous' time yet. Bomber goes first. There's a lock. Grievous held on to his Kraken calculate. One forward from the arc. <laughs> I think he's mad at this uh, this probe. Yeah, we'll see if this hero probe can survive this onslaught. <laughs> Epistasis. You know what? <laughs> I'm glad you were classy enough not to make it again, but when you say things like grievous error, I uh I feel like I already know. <laughs> Quack shot trolling in the chat. Not going down that route. Can't drag me down with you. Rick moves over the remotes, will roll. Is it a focus that they die on? Yeah, it's an eyeball. <laughs> Oddball says ramming speed. Yeah, he tried and missed. <laughs> he ran as fast as he could towards that uh, towards that probe and bounced right off of it. Yeah, Rick, not interested in that engagement. Gonna let the arcs go in, take some of the uh, the beating. And I think that's a good plan, right? You let Rick find the engagement that he wants. Let him let him get in on the flanks and let the arcs um, attack from the front. Oh, is that a one hard to the right? Yep. Obi Wan not interested in that, and this is this is so great for Jason, right? Like he got a free turn of target locks, and now he gets to come into the next engagement with um, calculates. I don't think he's going to re-target lock these arcs. There's not a whole lot of reason to. But man, this is really in Jason's favor right now. I think. The arcs are going to start us off. They are pilot skill two. So here it is into the probe droid four dice range one. Hit hit focus. He spins it. Ooh, and that's a dead probe. He trolled long enough. R.I.P. Rest in power. Evogan says, I mean, now Alvin knows who the target is and can run away with that ship. That's fine. If you want to disengage with half of your list, that that is strong for the drones, right? Like, if you give what we saw last game, where um, the drones engaged... I think Quick Draw wasn't there yet, but it, the point is, if you let the drones pick off one to two ships a turn while you run away, that's better for the drones. but you need to PS kill as many of those drones as possible um, before they get their, you know, their, their big alpha strike. 
Oh, apostasis. Oh, let it go, man. <laughs> I, I guess I have to make that Rick Astley alt art now. Maybe I should make a poll. How many new patrons can I get if I make a Rick Astley, Rick Olier alt art? All right, dial's going down. Maybe we'll see some uh, some rock perching. <laughs> Cupcakes wants that Colby. You know what? If you if you can win the um, the coveted three uh, bounty months in a row, not in a row, but three bounty months, maybe I'll make a uh, a Colby Sperato alt art. <laughs> Here's the two bank and another calculate. Yeah, I think versus these arcs, they're gonna be just fine having their calculates and their normal three dice attacks, um, their three dice munitions attacks. So we see a, uh, a perch. Yeah, mutant saying, too few Sith infiltrators. They had their time in the sun, but yeah, it is kind of a bummer that we're not seeing any. My boy, 066, where you at? Oh no. Things that we're going to outlaw on stream. Making jokes about strutting their stuff. Star Fox barrel roll. I gotta create a, a rule document for this stream. All right, looks like there's a target lock on yellow. I did not think he'd be moving those. All right, it is the bomber, so maybe he's he can depend on his beefiness a little bit more. Fergus, thanks for the follow. One forward from the yellow arc. Oh, the rules will grapple with the true issues. <laughs> I mean, I've made my bed. I'm going to lie in it. I tried wordplay. I was very bad at it. And now the chat thinks uh, it's open season. Too hard. Ooh. Mm. Nope. Doesn't make it. He tried the old... GSP wiggle didn't work. Not enough wiggle room. Ooh. Rick with the two. Thanks to the new follows, guys. Jagsba. One bank boost. Yeah, he's gonna get in behind these arcs. Maybe maybe take the long way around. Maybe go around the old um Manatee Rock, bottom right corner. All right, yellow is going to. Oh, wait, no, we got Grievous, right? He's a four, two hits, one evade. Does he spin the focus? I think you take the shield there, yep. Looks like that was on yellow. YOLO yellow. Tron says, doesn't Ark die here? I don't think so. It's possible. Mm, three, six, nine. Yeah, it's possible. Here's the arc. Two focuses. Three, okay. Uh, blank focus. Spins a calculate, takes two. Looks like that's on brown. 
Leroy Brown. Baddest man in the whole damn town. Better than old King Kong. All right, we're going to stop there. One hit, two evades. And that is it for <laughs> Republic Shots. They are unable to PS kill one of these. So here we go. Here's our first unobstructed shot. Range two from Brown. Yep, that's three dice. Ooh, there's three crits. <laughs> Oof, two shields and a crit. Let's see what it is. Fuel leak. Oh no. Oh no, fuel leak. Oh. Oh. Get leaked, son. Yep, spends it for a crit. <laughs> he sees his chance. Oh, fuel leak's going off. Wounded. So fuel leak's gone. Wounded's up. Yep, green, range three. Spins it for hit, hit, crit. You know, remember that time that I said I don't think an arc dies this round? <sighs> That's a dead arc! Well, <laughs> nobody clipped that. <laughs> nobody clipped me going, I don't think an arc dies this turn. And then speed up until the arc dies that same turn. Okay, no more shots. Back to dials. And this is why you don't... This is why running with Rick and Obi is so dangerous, because this happens, right? Just these arcs, they, they go in... Uh, to engage on their own. There's no friends here to help try and snipe off one of these um, drones, and he gets punished. Rookie, thank you for the bits. This um, Atomic Empire, very nice store, huge, well air conditioned, which is something that's weird to brag about, but I'm, I'm sure any of you who have played in competitions you know how important that airflow is, but most importantly, they have beer on tap. I think I'm going to try and go between rounds and for the final, we'll have ourselves a little sip. Because that is a luxury we rarely get at game stores. Although, Dr. Moneypants, a uh, <laughs> friend of the stream, drinking at 11.30 yesterday, and I was like, isn't it a little early? He's like, hey man, I got nowhere to be. I'm an adult. Okay, man. Okay. Diesel, stop leaving the stream, man. When you when you leave, things die. I'm not completely unhappy with that result, but I want a fair game. I don't want some kind of magic juju causing ships to get destroyed. Two forward out of yellow. Do you have the three calcs on the table from... Uh, from Kraken. Three out of brown might be going for the block. I almost wonder if the arc turns away and just shoots out the back. Ooh, the bomber. Looks like yellow and the bomber going up here to threaten Obi-Wan, keep him from uh, engaging. Ooh, Boomail. Boomy. I tried to make that one an L. Thanks for the follow.
Cardstar, thanks for the follow. I keep checking my stream because I'm like, when when do they go live in uh, in Sacramento? <laughs> I've got to I've got to have a whole bunch of new follows and subscriptions and donations before Gold Squadron goes live again. This is my time, my time to shine. Looks like I'm safe. Oh, Purple did try to disengage, but oh no, Grievous got those side meats. The delicious side meats. He's going to get his re-roll. Ooh. There's the uh, focus full throttle evade from Rick, and he should have a shot on Grievous. Grievous doesn't have arc on him. He might get uh, a reroll, range three. So we do see the hard turn and a boost from Obi-Wan. Spins a force point. So Brown did shoot his. Sh let's uh, let's actually check. Looks like all but yellow spent uh, spent their energy shells. So here's uh, Obi Wan spends another force point. One evade takes two on yellow. There's half points. Twenty six to forty two. All right, Rick's going to try and snipe this brown. Um, he's got one hole left, so very likely to do it. Actually, brown might have done, yeah, brown did a, uh, a three-speed maneuver, so Rick doesn't get his extra. <sighs> brown is dead. 38 to 42, a lot closer now. A little bit closer now. Grievous, range one, four dice into the arc. 3 crits and a hit. One evade takes it on the shields. Nice. Yeah, I was gonna say he cleared those tokens off of uh, off of Rick a little soon. Here's the energy shell shot. Green, uh, not an energy shell. Sorry, he doesn't have his shells anymore. Two dice. Spins it for one. There's two evades thanks to the token. So Rick is fine. And yellow does have energy shells. Spins them now. Take a shot at uh, Obi. And there's that target lock he lined up two turns ago. Oh, no. Two blanks. Oh. Yeah, he spins the focus. Man, <laughs> right when I brag about that target lock. Rolls blanks into blanks. Dice game, baby. So yeah, not a uh, not able to get overlapping arcs on one target and now he's got Rick coming from one direction Obi coming from another and the arc probably gonna turn away well 
I don't know. The arc turning left could end up with some some arc on that uh, that blue drone on the rock. Yeah, Justin saying impervium is boss. Yeah, it's a nice little upgrade. Grievous at sixty four, pretty good ship. Initiative four. Kraken definitely strong. Relay. I think Alvin definitely respects Grievous. Most of the players that made it into this cut had to fight, have fought Jason at one point or another. this guy doing 2 hard no 2 talent roll interesting going to try and catch Rick here there's a 1 hard going to strut Onto that rock. Oh, I told myself I wouldn't. Looks like we, we don't have any charges left. I think there might be one on the bomber, actually. This guy's going to turn and wait and see if uh, purple comes to engage. Dr. Bunny Pants in the, the uh, stream, I, I was just talking about how you were encouraging, how you were, um, yeah, encouraging me to drink early in the day. I think I'm going to have to stop by the uh, the bar here for the finals. Four forward from yellow. Maybe just trying to get in the way. Ooh, reloads. Nice time to do it. Dr. Jinky Pants. <laughs> Look, there's more to him than that. There's a focus from the arc, and yep, he did turn in there. Probably has arc on blue. Ooh, with the sloop. Justin, the YouTube chat was just talking about how potent that uh, that Grievous Sloop can be, especially with Kraken when you can have that calculate. Ooh, does get the bump on uh, Obi Wan, so that's one ship that he doesn't have to worry about too much. I don't think he gets range on blue, but maybe? Oh, Mazur, no problem. Three hard out of Rick. Dodges most arcs. There's the full throttle evade. The bomber has not been touched, so no real chance of PS killing him. Yep, there's the focus. Yep, 
Obi-Wan didn't get range to blue. So we'll see uh, Rick here. Range two into the bomber. <laughs> no. Oh, you poor, poor little fella. Spins the calc, takes two crits on the bomber. Direct hit. And wounded. Halfs him. 56 to 42. Alvin takes the lead. Mr. Hats, <laughs> thanks for the follow. Um, Grievous with a shot into the back of the arc. Does he spin his calc? He's going to reroll it instead. Ooh, back to another focus. I think he's going to leave it. Oh, this is into um, to Rick. Okay, sorry, I thought that was into the. It looks like he didn't have arc, maybe on, on the arc. Range two from the arc onto blue. Two hits, one evade, spins the calculate to take nothing. No, it takes one, sorry. Sometimes the glare on those uh, on those dice. Tricky, tricky. All right, range two. I think it's hit crit, one evade. Direct hit, oof, those are uh, going around. 63 to 56, Jason takes the lead back. One hit. Spins the lock. I didn't even see him take that. Man, <laughs> these locks not working out. One natty evade. Hey, we will celebrate that all day. Yep, looks like he's got it. The bomber. Gonna shoot into the arc. Sees a better chance to hit something there. Nope. Gonna shoot into Rick. Still deciding. Uh, looks like hit crit. Double blanks. Hull breach, which doesn't really matter. Well, no, he, he does have two left. Double check that real quick. Yeah, they got six. He's got four damage cards, so two left. Yeah, Justin, talking about... Uh, we should be able to take the arc off the board next turn. And I'm inclined to believe him. Um, Grievous is stressed. Let's take a look at that dial, see what's blue. Uh, two banks, two and three forward. So probably see a two bank in. Not much there to punish. A little over 30 minutes left here. 56 to 63, very close. And uh, droids... <laughs> a lead with a droid army. Very tenuous. Uh, PS kills could come at any moment. I 
wonder if we'll see Blue spin around to threaten Rick or Obi-Wan. And I wonder if he just leaves the arc up to Grievous. It's been green around as well. Is there any maneuver for this arc? Does he just go as fast as possible? Two forward, so he's just gonna. St no, that's that's an actual. That's the thing that gets you off the rock with uh, grappling struts. So he's going for a block here. <clears throat> it reloads, nice. I dig it. Ooh, green's coming off as well. I wonder if he'll reload as well. There's not much there for him to do. Nope, he's going to barrel roll. Interesting. Ooh, is that a Talon? Sure looks like it. Gonna roll forward too. to be as close as possible to Obi-Wan. Too hard out of the bomber. Relieves that stress. Roll for wounded. And he takes a stress. Or is it only on a crit? Nope, there it is. I forget that I can do that. <laughs> I gotta do that more often. Ooh, does get the uh, the block on the arc. He does not go as fast as he can. He does a three bank. Maybe he's trying to PS kill that uh, blue ship if it stayed on the rock. But now Grievous. Yep, there's the two bank. We all saw it coming. He's got to boost into a focus if he wants it. He's got to calculate already. Let's actually look at, you know what? While you perform a primary, if you are not in the defender's firing arc, so it's not front arc or anything, it's just any arc. The defender's arc. Inrad says, why lock? I don't think he gets the rerolls because he's in the arcs, back arc. Um, and he has a calculate, so now he has rerolls and a calculate. I think I just pulled that up, right? This did come through, right? Yeah, it's it's not like the printed front arc. It's just firing arc. No problem. 
Lord Salgado. Thanks for the follow. Oh, jeez. One, two. So that's blue, I think. That's yellow, okay. PS killed. Oh, that was at the top of the board. That's right. Here's um, Obi Wan. Looks like two hits. Oh, and there's no calculate. So blue takes a damage. That will put him over half, but he's still alive. 81 to 63. Alvin does take the lead there. Grievous going to get this range one shot. Rolls blank focus into blank focus. If he spins it, yeah, then it's guaranteed to kill. It's a blank. 104th Battalion Pilot. Enjoy your trip home. 81 to 84, so close. Tora, thanks for the follow. Whew. Man, they just keep trading that lead. And this is the situation that Jason wanted to be in, which is get the arcs off the board, then you deal with um, Rick and Obi. Ooh. Spins one. This is an energy shell from the bomber. I didn't know he still had him. All right. And it looks like that was uh, negated there. Yep, we see all shields remaining on Obi-Wan. Give him back all of his force points. 27 minutes left, 84 to 81. It, I know the points are in Jason's favor, but I, it just seems like Obi-Wan and Rick <laughs> are going to be able to delete a vulture per turn if they want. But we'll see. Marcel says, is this the, uh, what, uh, what round is this? This is top four. Final will be next. Yeah, I think we'll see here. I'm curious how many people in your chat right now are saying hello there. <laughs> Nobody, because I outlawed it on my stream. You can't say that, and you can't say Star Fox barrel roll shit. <laughs> Outlaw. <laughs> Instant ban. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You heard that chat, right? <laughs> oh no, Mega Silver looking for his uh, one-way ticket out of the stream chat. But yeah, uh, that was our TO. Josh sees uh, this confrontation between Grievous and Obi-Wan. And that was something I was about to bring up is this could be where we see Grievous take the team on his back and carry it to victory. go to bank out of the bomber looks like he's just moving into a blocking position that doesn't relieve stress three hard out of green down here kept his kraken calculate reloads all right 
Ooh, smooth with the subscription. Enjoy those emotes. Two forward from Grievous. Ooh. I'm, I'm going to try. Yuta Nast. Thank you for the subscription. Ooh. Super Tantu. These are fun. Uh, three hard out of Rick. Should get his die versus everything out here. Till Marion. Thank you. Might turn that sound down just a little bit. It was Rookie gifting subs. Oh! Credit where credit is due. Thank you, Rookie. Now I see it. Ooh, enjoy those emotes, guys. Enjoy your Natty Lights, your Yodas. Quad jumpers? I think, uh, I think Enrique, the Enrique uh, heroic emote is the only one reserved, especially for Lou. All right, so Rick uh, moves up and barrel rolls back. I think Rick is he is he setting up a faster maneuver next turn? Oh, Mega Silver. We we said we weren't going to, and by we I mean I said it, and you all agreed by proxy. A lock on blue, who's got one haul, should be manageable there. Bomber's got two hull left. Three dice from Rick. Hit crit. Two <laughs> Natty evades. Mm -mm. Range one from Obi, 4v2. Target lock, three force points. Yeah, spin the lock. Ooh, spin. He's going to save the force. And that is a dead blue. PS killed. 93 to 84. This is a regen OB. So while it may seem like you do meaningful damage. Oh, they're checking to see if he's in arc. I think he is. I don't think we're going to get any grievy goodness. Creamy, gravy. Uh, there's got to be some kind of gravy joke we can make with Grievous. Uh, three hits with the focus. One evade takes two. Spins a force point for that. Yeah, Smooth says, cool to see a droid swarm in the top four. Yeah, I'm, I'm very... <laughs> excited about that there was I think the top eight was all resistance and Republic except for the uh, this list and the fo list that got knocked out round one by this list why why such cruel circumstances had to force them against each other All right, got the bomber out here with uh, with the stress. Has not relieved that. Tried to get a block in, didn't quite make it. Man, it just it feels like Obi Wan can just delete green. It, it seems very capable of of Ricky, Ricky. You know what, Ricky, Rick Olie. Uh, and Obi-Wan to mop up the bomber and the Trade Federation drone, and then it's those two, ooh, boy. Put them wherever you want. <laughs> Ricky Bobby. 
lobby. Oh, there's... I have a whole list of possible Rick Ollier alt arts, and now i got to put Ricky Bobby in there. Del Preston. Do what? Del Preston. That's okay. what I want to make. The roadie um, from Wayne's World. Yeah. I like it. <laughs> that is a good one. It's a good Dell alt art. Make them double sided. You, you know what? Because there are so many Rick alt art ideas, I think double sided would be good. Or bang for your buck. That's a red maneuver. Looks like a sloop. Looks like he's going to hit his own bomber. Huh. That's not good. Ooh, is that a K? It has to be. No way you're heading that fast towards the uh, the board edge. Oh, he he is. He is doing that. I, I mean, he can't... Well, I guess he could hard turn if he's not... Obi-Wan might have flown too close to the sun. Going to get the uh, get a camera in there. Yeah, it's not a 4K. But if he's on, he should be able to hard turn the next turn to stay on, right? Oh, he touches it. Yep. So that uh, that ship is off. Oh, no, 72 points. Oh, no. Oh, man. Rick Olier, he's got a lot of work to do. Yeah, I mean, Alvin knows he's still got a chance. <laughs> Timo says, Rick, we're never going to let you down. Oh! I was trying so hard not to say that on stream. Timo. Also, thanks for the donation. A little late, Timo. I don't know why it didn't show up in the overlay, but uh, thank you very much. Uh, three hits. Ooh! Oh, that's into the Separatist drone over here. One, two, three. One, two? Oh, that's an evade. In, that's in the glare there. 106 to 156. Two hits. Spins the evade. 15 minutes left. Obi-Wan Kenobi. Yeah, I think uh, Alvin said he's like, I think, you know, it's just, you got to go over and walk to that board edge and look at things. I think some people just, uh, you know, they get set in their view. They don't walk and check. Um, and I think that, that cost him Obi-Wan. I, I don't know that he would have... Maybe. I don't know if it would have changed what he thought that maneuver would have done, but he definitely recognizes that uh, 
Maybe should have mulled that one over. Maybe should have done a few more laps around the table. But yeah, it was a daring maneuver. Cost him his life. You know, I choose to believe that he fled. That, that is the rule, right? You, you don't die. You flee. It's actually more insulting, probably. Obi-Wan versus Grievous. Grievous flees the battle. Two bank out of green there. They're just trying to get in the way of these three hard turns. He was trying to get out of here with his points. Yeah, there's the three hard. Rick doesn't have any choice. He's, he's got to go hard. <laughs> he's got to be aggressive, be aggressive. Gotta, he's got to PS kill that bomber. Range two, two hits. And that is a dead bomber, I think. Uh, maybe not. I'll double check on that. Blank, blank, focus. Spins the target lock and the calculate for hit crit. Spins the evade. Yep, and there goes the bomber. 124 to 156. Yeah, Alvin's calling for, for Rick to bring it home. And boy, it's looking more and more possible. Does green, let's check the uh, the board here. I think green, no, green has spent his, uh, his energy shells, so take that out there. Looks like a three hard from the Vulture. Maybe looking to perch. I don't think he makes it. Maybe. Linden, thanks for the follow. Oh, goes for the barrel roll. Looking to block the uh, three hard. Yep, there's the linked action calculate. Too hard from Grievous, and it looks like he's trying. If he thinks he gets the bump, yeah, he's going to be out of arc there. Yeah, that's going to be a bump. No way. Yeah, okay. Got to make sure those back arc back uh, guides are in cuz really going to affect Oh, I think I think Rick does get a shot there. One hit. Two blanks, gonna reroll with Grievous 
and take it. It's getting tense, 124 to 156. Remove these dice. Right. Too hard. Gets on the rock. It was in. Yeah, it was in arc. They both agreed. No problem. There's the sloop from Grievous. Talon from Rick, and he's he's waiting on the next turn. Looks like we're just going to rotate green here. I think he's already got a target lock. Three forward out of Grievous. Bank gets the full throttle evade. Ooh. Green does not have. Let's take a look. Where is he? Oh, he's up there towards the top. The only vulture remaining, but uh, no energy shells. Spins it for two. Takes a shield off of uh, off Rick. All right, gonna do a little sit and spin here. Calculate. Looks like another sloop out of Grievous. Yeah, quack shot. Yeah, we, we discussed that at the uh, beginning of the game. But yes, the reveal dial on the droid, even if it's not executed, still messes with, um, with Rick. And, and Jason knows that. Alvin knows Jason knows that. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, the uh, the droid will always reveal a three-speed maneuver to mess with um, Rick. Takes... Yep. Oof. Takes two on Grievous. One twenty four to one fifty six. There's range one into Rick. Three dice versus two. Spins the lock. Spins the two calculates for three. Two evades. Two 
Takes one on Rick. Not half points yet. And these uh, Grievous rerolls not uh, not resulting in much here. Uh, Myth asking for the the way to droids get off the uh, rocket. Yeah, it's a two speed maneuver. Let's see, can we bring that up? That's the uh, open. I gotta play with that more. So Grievous moves up, gonna barrel roll, try and block a three speed maneuver here. Looks like green just gonna hang out there. And Rick gonna bump. Range one from the droid, three V. I think they both did three speed maneuvers. Spins it for a hit crit, two blanks, and yep, Alvin calls it there. I think he had one left, but he's not worried about it. So, wow. All right, well that's gonna do it there. Congratulations to Jason riding the Separatists into the finals. What a story. A Cinderella story, even. Um, yeah, thanks to both players for playing. Congrats to Jason. Thanks to both player. Thanks to everybody for watching. Uh, that's going to do it for this match. I'll be back with the finals ASAP. Stick around.